What is the correct way to deal with winning streak? Winning streak simply means that the dumbbell wins successively on the tables. For example, say you bet on bunker high with Baccarat at the end. Then you bet again for the second time and you win again. Then you bet again for the third, the fourth, the fifth, and so on, and you only win on your games. That, my friend, is a winning streak. Hello, are you a casino gambler? If you are, I have a free ebook for you. This ebook reveals the 9 deceptively simple, yet outrageously destructive casino mistakes that even smart gamblers perpetually make. If you can avoid these mistakes, you can avoid becoming the casino's melted cow. Download it free from my website at www.samontesystem.com. Winning strikes do happen, only they don't happen often. In a game where both sides have equal chances to win, say, like tossing a poem, hit coming out 10 successive times will happen only once in 1054 tosses. At least this is what mathematics had predicted it would. The only problem with winning streaks is that nobody could know when they would happen. Sometimes they occur right in the start, or many times in a evening or never occur in months. Most casino regulars have experienced winning streaks. Have you? Most gamblers don't know what to do with their winning streaks. Only very few smart gamblers do. There are even dumb gamblers who run away from it. Yes, really. There are gamblers who run away from winning streaks. And I call them the killjoys. Let me share to you one of my experiences with killjoys. I was playing blackjack that time at one of the casinos in Cebu City, Philippines. It was late evening and I was alone on the table. Suddenly, two young players sat beside me. I sensed they were partners because they consulted each other when there was a decision to make. They also had common man. Not long after they played, the cards ran in their table. Dell after Dell, they won. They were not good players, but they won anyway. Since their bits were bigger, their winnings piled up fast before them. I counted their winnings. It was seven times in a row. Then they talked to each other silently as though they were deliberating on a certain decision. Then to my surprise, they stopped playing. They scoped their chips and walked away. This kind of gamblers will never have a chance to win big in their gambling. I would rather that they stay at home or go vacationing somewhere. Quitting in the middle of a winning streak is not a quick way of dealing with it. It is a blunder, a big no. The reason is simple. He is not taking advantage of his winning streak. It is as though he waited a long time for the winning streak to occur. But when the opportunity arrives, he let it slips away. Until now, it is still beyond me why there are gamblers who run away from winning streaks. 